All right, welcome back to Uncharted Territory 3. Uh, so we know the lie of the land in the area where Blackwell is. And we're going to go and have an assault on it. There's a pit at the far end which we're going to try and scale down. Completely forgot that was still there. Oh man, we're going to get... Dish ha, 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 not funny, not funny. How did that? No. Oh well, <laughs> that was um, that was this area for you. Um, right at the start as well. Now we took out that spawner over there, and it's a smaller pillar. So I think I want to try and risk that going like going over here instead of going over there. There's so there's several entrance. This is like um that Star Wars place, Ka Kashik. Is it? No, not Kashik. Upita, you know that place Obi Wan fights General Grievous. It's like the the pit and there's the layers. It's pretty cool. So yeah, I could just end a pearl down there, but I don't. I've no idea what's down there. So we're just gonna, I think, get a staircase. It's probably the best option. Uh, we got more like better blocks. They're lighter, and they're resistant to gas balls. So that's good. Now, unfortunately, we might. Oh dear. Okay, I just wasted one. I'm trying to see, so the nearest gas spawner's down there. Yeah, we're gonna. There's gonna be tons of gas. I'm not sure where we're aiming for. To be honest, I think down there would have been a better place to go for. But if we get down, I don't really care as long as we get to the floor. Let's keep going the way we're going, and we're gonna try and take out that gas spawner. Easier said than done, obviously, but we can hope. Right, one spawned, as expected. Let's see where we are. We can try and kill it. Yeah, he didn't see us. Oh, it's right there. It's right there. First, we're coming to a part where it's just purely obsidian, which means we might not be able to reach it. Uh oh. I think now would be a time for fire rays. Okay. The one down below is active as well. See you later. Uh, might as well pot strength as well. Okay. I'm not too bothered about saving glass bottles anymore. Right, we can't dig down anymore. Unless we want it to take flipping ages. So we're going to have to go down the outside. Even then, that's going to take ages as well. My goodness. best we can hope for, unfortunately. Let's do that, just for good measure. I mean, we do have fire eyes, so maybe it would be better if we fell into it. Alright. So far, so good. The fact that we've got to make this descent is just so... Oh my goodness. Like... Can we dig this? No, we can't dig that. We can't stop to dig obsidian like this. I'm going to try and... We really want to get rid of more spawners. We kind of want to jump down into the water, but if we jump down, there probably is no getting back up. At least we didn't disable the lava source completely, because if we did that, you know, the lava source might be there for a reason. Or it, it might benefit us in some way, you know, it might light up a spawner far below that we, you know, cannot see. We're going to unfortunately activate that spawner down there. But... Rubbish! It's not even moving. Oh, flip. Yeah, that's that's act is active now. It wasn't back there. Got that one. <laughs> Hope 
Hopefully that was a blaze spawner we took out. If it wasn't the gas spawner. There we go, gas spawner gone. Excellente. Alright, we're making our way downtown. I, I mean down, uh, down here. Smoothly. Right. Tons of diamonds. First observation, tons of diamonds. Which way looks the right way? Could be any one of them, right? <laughs> A bunch of mobs just spawned. I've got fear. Okay, we've still got three minutes of strength, so there's no point in... No point reporting just yet. Oh, dear. Yeah, he doesn't do anything. Got him. He doesn't do anything. We don't have to fear him, I don't think. I hope not. Oh, oh zombie pigmen. That's not good. It doesn't look like this is the right one. There's nothing here. It's just diamonds. Time to go. Time to go pronto. Flip, there's a witch. And I don't think that witch was a natural spawn somehow. This blaze definitely wasn't a natural spawn. It's got strength for some reason. There's something up there. No. Alright, killed... Killed the... Bad guy. What you call them? Oops. Yeah, I killed the gas through the head of the giant zombie who doesn't give any flips about us. This is so dangerous. We've got a stack of blocks left. Huh! I didn't bag on that happening. We still got fire rays, so we can just do that. Oh my goodness, there's a blaze. Where, 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 where? There. There we go. Um, yeah, the blaze, are, the blaze is there, unfortunately. This is prob- there's probably- I, I, I think I've had better ideas in the past. Def I've definitely had better ideas in the past. But... You can't credit- you can't uh, deny that I'm, I'm trying. Okay, kill those two guys. Fire res. Runs out soon. Okay, time to do that. And uh, let's report just in case the worst happens. Oh my goodness. No, you don't. Strength, let's report strength just in case the worst happens. Why is there so many, like, big zombies? Giant zombies. Let's do that. More blaze. Do that, do that, do that, do that, and man, this fire—it was so lucky us getting that this fire raise. Or maybe it was so unlucky. Who knows? Uh oh. What are those guys got? Strength. Whoa. Right. So what are we doing here? What are we doing? Plan. Plan is yolo. There's a witch coming in. No idea what she's to. <laughs> I just shot it through the through the fire. All right, stuff it. Who cares? Flipping YOLO. Are we in? Are we in? Oh my goodness! This fire is annoying. Don't worry. Yeah, the fire is annoying me more than it's annoying you. I think this is the right way. I think this is the right way. There it is. Yep, there it is. The cave spider spawner. But there is the wool chest. Emeralds? Oh, there's the abyss. Uh oh. This is going to get hairy. 
Oh no, 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 no. I need to take that spawner out really quick. Oh, that's not good. What the heck? Are these the fire mites? Or are they just regular... I have no idea what they are. There it is. I feel like we've got to be around the other side. Get out of the way, big zombie. You're doing nothing. I apologise for the uh, incredibly loud sounds. It's still loud even when it's up. Right. We're we just gonna go in. I don't know what the plan, what the best course of action here is to do. That's silverfish. We're getting chased by these blooming idiots. Nope. Oh my giddy ant! Well, rip water. Nope. This is practically impossible. I've been hit by everything. Uh, what do I do now? My armor's still intact. I need to get blocks. Glowstone's literally the only block I've got. I just need to go back in. I need to go back in. This is it. I've got every. I've played it safe up till now. Unfortunately, maybe I could try. And, I could try. Let's light up. Keep lighting up. Got one. Got two. Got three. Right, oh, got that guy. This is flipping crazy. I want the water back. Let's go in. No skellies, please. No skellies, please. Please, no skellies. Hi, big zombie. <laughs> you can't hurt me. Oh man, there's a blaze. Let's just go in. Flipping YOLO. Oh, there's only three. I hate it when there's only three. <sighs> right, we need to think about our escape. Because there's only three black wool. Um... We've played it well. Unfortunately, we've got no water. That's the problem. I would really, I really wish we had water. Whoa! Oh, that was the potions. Yeah, I really wish we had water. We've got no blocks, except glowstone. We do have the enderpearl. That's probably going to be our route out of here. Right, we're just going back the way we came, right? So, ready? Right over there, I hope. Right, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Move, 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 we've got, we definitely have black, but we do, we do. Oh my goodness, we, it's not over yet, it's not over till it's over. It's not over till it's over. I've got two minutes of fire rays. Two minutes of fire rays. Right, that was probably a waste of time. Wait. What happened here? Stuff it, we've got fire rays. Oh, we're above, we're above the pillar. Right, we need to be in here. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> I, I entered at the wrong place. Right, come on, we've got Black Will, we've got Black Will. We used our only Ender Pearl, unfortunately. I think it was justified, though. I can barely hear anything now. We've still got 27 Glowstone. We don't have any water, which is the main worry. My main worry. Man, this is so tense. And once we get up out of this uh, pit, We've then got to traverse the train up there, although if no mobs spawn, if we've lit up well enough around our route, it should be okay. Oh my goodness. There we go. Uh oh. All good, all good. It's all under control. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. We're not home and dry yet, but... I am relieved we, that that's at least, at least we know it's possible. So, we've made it back to the intersection. After a great adventure, we have uh, no water. We also have uh, black wool, which we shall put there. 
that I think is all the will we need. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to let's head back to the monument. I'll record, obviously, and if I die on the way back, you'll see. But all the wool's in there, so it like it's not we're not going to the wool in the block, dime block. It's in there, so it's not as if like if I die, it's over, you know, because it's in the ender chest. I guess while I'm going back, I could just talk about this map a bit. Like, I mean, in theory it's done. I shouldn't have any problems unless I keep dying over and over again. But even then I can just break my bed. Um, this has to be, on balance, one of my favourite maps. Like, probably my, uh, probably the favourite map of all time, CTM. And that's not just because I did well in it. Because I didn't die an awful lot. Let's do stats. Well, for the moment, the number of times I've died, 16. That is not too bad for me. I mean, think about how many deaths I had last time. I didn't even check to see how many deaths I had last time, but I'm pretty sure it was quite a lot. Um, it was... That helped, obviously. It That obviously contributes to the fact I enjoyed it so much, is because I did so well at it. But just, like, things like the custom mobs, the range of things you can do, like, usually in CTM maps... You've got a limited stuff. You hardly ever get full diamond. I mean, when do you ever get full diamond? I mean, JC got it in Waking Up, but that was like... We were home and dry by that point. Um, whereas I, I've had lots of diamond armor for the whole the whole point. Eh, the whole, well, not the whole time, but, you know, I had lots at the... Uh, near the start, like half diamond, three-fourths, and I lost it when I died. But overall, overall, just things like that. I mean, I think... There was possibly a wee bit too much loot because I, I didn't I didn't end up using everything, and it definitely wasn't the hardest CTM ever. I'm not gonna lie. It was I wouldn't say it was like really easy. I'm just I think I've got more experience with like CTM now. I've got more, you know, more of an idea of what I'm doing. I I can make decisions better. So I think that's all contributed to my success here. And I've actually recorded this in so little time. I'm pretty sure I started this only a few days ago. And it's taken me very, uh, very, very small amount of time to complete it. So that's pretty good. And obviously you get those people that speedrun these CTA maps. And yeah, good for them. But I'm just here as a casual gamer. Doing it in my own time on my own Steam. And boom. We have completed Uncharted Territory 3. So we've completed all the Uncharted Territories. Uh, 3 was definitely the best for me. And then I didn't uh, two I didn't perform well in, so that's the worst. But other than that, they, they're 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 definitely a good a good range of uh, maps. They're not as hard as uh, super hostile, definitely, but it's still fun nonetheless. I mean, I had a lot of fun. You could argue it was made easier by the fact I had strength and I had a you know a smite four and breaking three sword for most of the map. And yeah, 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 you could argue all that. But I mean, think about it. In a CTM map, it's survival. If you obey the rules, then you can do basically anything you want. And there was no rules against enchanting to level 30 or brewing strength extended pots or fire res or anything like that. So overall, I uh, I have to say I'm pretty chuffed with how this has gone. Um, I kept the episode number down. Um, I'm pretty sure Team Canada th did this and they struggled for one of the world, but I can't remember which one it was. Anyway... Um, and with that, I will sign off there. Again, thanks very much for watching this and the series. Your company has been much appreciated. I will see you, hopefully, in another video.